all right beautiful people this is the video you guys been requesting you were requesting for me and malachi to wash his hair in the shower everybody was giving us such a hissy fit about us washing the hair in the sink so now he's gonna wash his hair in the shower and he's gonna use fruities yes he's gonna use the fruities non-sulfate shampoo and we and we um are in our other house so we don't have the um we don't have the conditioner i didn't get a chance to, to buy some conditioner so we just gotta do what we have we gotta wash his hair though because it's been over a month since i washed his hair all right start when it up they gonna start like i said he gotta start learning how to manage it huh um you yeah they I can see you so he's wetting it wetting he's wetting it up I don't want him to wet the floor. That's the reason why. Shower curtain here, but anyway, here. Turn around, I'm finished with it. This shower curtain here, I almost done bit and broke. We have to buy another another shower curtain. But it's still holding on for the time being. Okay. Wet the back, good. You're not wetting it back up, oh, good. And he do wash his hair. As you can see, he still got his diabetes, his insulin pod on the arm. It, the insulin pod normally stays on well. Okay, now. Just turn around and just let the water run in the back of the hair. See, that's why I have to always direct him because it's like the more I keep trying to teach him how to, to wash his hair, this is why eventually it's going to get cut, guys, because he just can't, like he just don't know how to manage it. <laughs> no, when your hair is very thick like this, you got to know how to manage and wash it. got to let the water soak through all of it because it's so thick. Why you lifting it for you end up tangling it up? I mean, you just need to be spreading it apart with your hands in the bag so it can wet it. It's a gradual process, guys. I'm still. Okay. 
It's just a gradual process. And if he don't learn quick, this is it's just gonna get cut because I'm just really tired of messing with it too. I am just tired because he is about to be an adult. And I am just tired of tired of fooling with it myself, to be true. You can have long hair, but it's the thing that you got to learn how to manage it. And then he's a boy anyway. So you just probably have to cut it down below the shoulder. That way it'll be easy, more easy for him to manage. To manage it. Is it wet up good so we can start on shampoo? Yes. All right. Well, you can turn the water off. You can turn the water off. Turn the water off and shampoo it. And you need to do it straight in here. Here. Oh, down. You need to um, wash it with the hair down. Don't keep doing it all of that. And keep it from tangling up. Wash it like I showed you like that. With your hands and rub your hands together. Because if you wash it, you keep tangling it up. Don't be, don't be doing all of this. Just wash it, pull it, hold it down, and do it like this. Rub it together with your hands. I thought I showed you how to do it. I've been, I told you you got to do it all the way down to the ends and do like this. This helps to rub your hands together with the hair. It helps get it, it get all the dirt and stuff out of it. Your dad showed you how to wash it. Mm. Yeah, you got to do it. Mm-hmm. And you guys can be like his mom sometimes sounds so agitated all the time. I am, guys. <laughs> I am sometimes because I have eight children and he and Malachi is number six. And Jesus, if you only knew, like I told you, you know, we pray and we keep on going because what don't kill us definitely make us stronger when we got God in our corner. And we depend and we truly pray to, sincerely to God. Malachi got ailments with diabetes. Then I got a son. My baby boy with autism on the autism spectrum. So sometimes I am agitated. And then I have five adult children. My um, Then I have a 14-year-old daughter. That's, her and Malachi is almost the same age. Come on, turn around. So sometimes on top of working, stress from working, I've been working here for years, ever since I was 14 years old, and I'm in my 40s now. So life, everything, sometimes I am agitated, irritated, frustrated, look, and, and look at this hair, and with this type of hair, and sometimes it look, it is just like the water ain't even touched it. What it looks like? It's just like the water ain't even got into the into the scalp good because of the type of hair he got is so thick. I tell you guys, I always put a, a, a sock on my hand. I put a sock, just get some old socks and hold the brush. That's good. I need to turn off the water because I need to comb through his hair. I need to comb through it. Brush through it, I mean. Stay up. All you're going to get some water if you need to. Just trying to brush through it a little bit. So it won't be so tangled when he get out because Malachi hair tangles really bad. It gets, come over to make sure they can see. Come on, come on. His 
hair gets tangled so bad sometimes. And it, that's when we know too the ends need to be cut. Alright, so just rinse it up. Now it's good enough. I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on this hair today. Let's rinse it because because we have to blow dry and shampoo it and groom it tomorrow. Why don't you just turn around and then do that after it's rinsed it all out and then do that. And look how he's washing it, guys. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, help me. <laughs> Oh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. lift it and push it all back in one direction. That's the thing that be making me so agitated because he don't know how to manage it. Like if you got long hair, use your fingers, lift the hair up and and wash it. He grab it, quit trying to like you scared to grab the hair. Grab it and. Manage it so it won't tangle back up and wash it. Now you need to turn in the front because you still film in the front. Yep, just keep brushing it back like that in one direction. So is it you washing out in the front? All right, let me see. This is for the low. Because I have brushed through it a little bit, so a little bit. So this is what it looked like now, guys. And, I, and you guys, make sure y'all watch this video, please, to the end, so you can see it. So this is what it looks like now. Okay, now just let it wet up in the, in the scalp for water. Wash it good. Mm -hmm. Rinse it up good. All right, guys. Um. We're going to wrap it up. Now look how this is done. He is good now. Okay. And this is what his hair looked like. Stand up there. This is what it looked like when it's stretched out and washed good. All right, guys. Thank you guys for watching. And this is the um, video you guys requested for him to wash his hair in the shower. <laughs>